Hey everyone, West with X here. Most of us know the value of having a personal first aid kit. We bring it with us in our vehicles or if we go out and about. Um, but the question is, is it worth it to spend the extra money on an X here for that kit? If you buy kits pre-made, get one on Amazon or somewhere, it's probably gonna have a cheap little shears in it. Um, and so today we're gonna kind of look at, is it worth the money to put an X shear in there? Surprise, we think so. And the reason is, for all the reasons that a professional chooses X shear, uh, when they're gonna depend on it day after day, are the same reasons that when you pull that first aid kit out and something really depends on it, that you're gonna want a quality product in there. Uh, one scenario we have today here is uh, dirt biking. Seth loves the dirt bike, so we're out here today um, in the woods. We're gonna be riding around a little bit, and we're gonna take a look at some scenarios where having an X year and having that first aid kit could really make a difference. One of the things we've talked about many times is how much better the X shear cuts than traditional shears. And that can go for a brand new pair of traditional shears will not cut as quickly through heavy material, especially something like motocross gear, heavy jackets, things like that. And so if you're out riding a dirt bike, we like to ride up in Northern Michigan. There's a lot of this kind of pine forest. And if you come off the bike or miss a corner and one of those branches uh, sticks, uh, gives you a thoracic injury, maybe hits an artery, something like that, you're gonna need access to that very quickly. Obviously, an artery, we're going to put a tourniquet on over the clothes. But if it's something more minor where you need to access the wound, especially for a thoracic injury or a chest seal, we want to be able to get those clothes off really quick. And so that's where this comes in. Just look at all these like opportunities to get impaled by tree branches. I have a uh, first aid kit that I built that I keep with me in my truck. And of course, I have a pair of trauma shears in there. We have this heavy Carhartt jacket and going through all the uh, layers uh, twice. You can move really, really quick. So right there, I'm cutting even more because I have it bunched up. And it allows you to get that jacket off, get access to the injuries very, very quickly. Try not to die here. Gotta clear the trail. So let's say you're out here clearing trails and you have some kind of an injury, foot, boot, uh, glove, hand here, if you have a crush injury or something like that. Another advantage of having a really quality pair of trauma shears is if you're going through this thick leather, the X shear, as we demonstrated, cut really well all the way down through that leather. And you can get someone out of some gloves or some boots with the minimum amount of pain. We're able to do this without manipulating the hand almost at all. Thanks for joining us today. Let us know in the comments what you'd like to see us cut next. Tell us how you use your trauma shears and we'll see you next time.